good morning everybody it's moving day today and we're moving from this site here at Chichester and we're moving to another one near Bognor Regis so the troops are just getting ready we've all had a nice shower while we got that bit of electrical cup last night and uh, this other site we're going to is £13 an hour it will save looking for somewhere to park it will save car parking fees and most importantly of all it'll be a nice safe place to leave the van because this is our home so we don't want to just leave it anywhere I mean we have got to leave it sometimes we've got a steering lock insurance all that kind of thing but it's not something we make a habit of if we can help it does that feel better? Morning. yeah it's nice to have a fresh shower and it, is. it just we take advantage of when we've got water and electricity especially to make a habit of yeah. doing it yeah. but uh, to be fair it doesn't use a lot of gas but right let me get things put away. Plenty of room here, isn't there, in this CL? Nice here, it's lovely. Yeah, let's look at the size of this place. Just filled up, with, parts of filled up with water. And uh, we're going to be parked down the bottom there. Yeah, there's uh, quite a few low hanging trees along here. So. Well, he said we've got all the bottom. Yeah, he said just if you want to park down the bottom, you can have the whole bottom of the field to yourselves. So very nice we've got chickens and a potato garden patch very nice plenty of room down this end for us and we can use all this piece obviously they're only allowed five units on here but yeah we're within 10 minutes i think 10 minutes walk 10 minutes bike ride of the beach from here so it's well out of the way a bit tight getting in here real tight in something like this I've got my self leveling system out there preparing us because these vans lean forwards regardless of whether you're parked on the level or not. I'm waiting for the indication are we level? Are we level, Zaki? Um, I think we're pretty level. <sighs> right, this will do nicely down here. And chickens are just over there. I believe you can buy their eggs as well. So if we run out of eggs, we'll be fine, won't we? Legs. Let's go and say hello to the chickens. Hello, chick chicks. Oh, you've got a nice run, ain't ya? Hey, this is nice, eh? Do you lay lots of nice eggs in here? Look at his rooster he's got. He said the rooster's not an early riser, so we're glad about that. We are. There's a little pen for him. Eh? Yeah? As you can see, lots of room here. £13 a night, you can't grumble for that. Obviously there's toilets, showers, uh, water point, L sand point, all the usual things, no electricity. But we're fully charged from where we were so we should be fine. And it looks like Catherine is already going to be on washing duties. <laughs> well, it's, <laughs> Maybe. A nice, it's a nice warm breeze and I've, we've already got a tank of hot water haven't we because the water's been on all morning so, so I might as well just put a bit of, get a bit of washing done while it's the right weather to do it. Possibly. Oh, just looked at the weather forecast, it looks like it's going to be like this for oh. the next week. That's oh, alright. It is. Oh, she's got set up around here, look. <coughs> We've got battery packs out. We've got the washing machine out. Mm -hmm. Why not? Wait, wait till we get mumps of rain. We're stuck in van. Oh no. <laughs> dreading them. I'm dreading that time. I don't mind cold weather. No. That doesn't bother me. No. This is still going strong and for anybody who's wondering, because we did have a couple of comments about you know, not rinsing your clothes and they might smell of um, detergent. detergent and all that. Catherine does them in the bucket afterwards as a bit of a rinse. Mm. Yeah. Um, yeah. We found it works really well like that. Yeah. Some people have said about putting water in the spinner, it won't spin properly. It won't, no. So we just do it like you used to do it in the old fashioned days. Yeah. Take them it. out there, rinse them through some clean fresh water. Yep. Bang them in the spinner, 
jobs are good. And uh, they've come out brilliant, haven't they? Yeah. So while we've only got a few bits and a nice day, it makes sense, doesn't it? It does. And then it's done then, you don't have to think about doing I it. I might get the old Ellie Glide out in a minute, bike yeah. out, and I might head down to the seafront. Might also be a good excuse to uh, sort the garage out. All on my own. On your own. Why are you stopping here? Oh yeah, I'm doing this, aren't I? Well, I might just go and scan the route yeah, out. Yeah, scout out, see where we are, what's around. Need to put some uh, air in them tyres as well. Might do that while find the uh, well the pumps there. <laughs> I was just about to say find the pump for the tyres, and mm -hmm. it's just there. How convenient! Started summit now. Most of the stuff out, <laughs> and a bit of a tidy out in the back. What we've decided is move everything to that side, and just have that lane for the bikes. Because mm. when we get the other bike, we'll want to go in as it no. was. So all the bits we don't need, like the fishing tackle at the minute, now it's getting to winter, all's gone underneath the yeah, it's, other side floor. It's daft, isn't it? Because we've got, still got so much empty room under there, yeah. we might as well. Well, we did have. Well, we did have. <laughs> we filled it up, mm. we just pumped the tyres up on the bike. Me and Zach are going to pedal into the seafront, have a look at the sea, just to see how far it is and the route. And then uh, when we get out tomorrow, we'll probably take the trailer, the dog. Yeah. And try and make a day of it out there. Have a bit of a trail run with the trailer, can't we? For the minute. And yeah. Washing's going well. Oh, beautiful sunshine. We don't need no sunshine at the minute. Well, we do, but not for solar. I was actually eating some pizza, and then me and him are going to have a quick ride and uh, scout out the route. Me and Zach have scouted out the route down into Bognor Aegis. Um, just had a quick scoop there and back. Catherine has got all the washing done. So that's out drying, charging that back up while the sun is shining and we've got the trailer out and just south or no just west of Bognor you can take the dogs on the beach three kilometres away so we're going to whip Boo down in his new trailer now he's back to his old self and uh, take him for a little run on the beach before tea's ready what do you reckon Bo? Have you a little whip down on the beach? You know you like the beach, don't you? You never had a real good go in that trailer yet, so should be alright, it's all pathways pretty much to get there. So yes. It's another glorious day. Beautiful, and there's nobody joined us, so should be very peaceful tonight here. To the beach, it's mm -hmm. a bit windy. Let's go and have a little oh, look. Yes, it's uh, turned a tad windy, so we've locked the bikes up. Boots first out, it didn't go too bad. But uh, it slides all over in that uh, yeah, trailer. Yeah, we've got to figure out something to do with the bottom of it, so it can grip it with his feet. Because being Boo, he just wanted to stand up all the way here. Yeah, I think he enjoyed it. Thank <laughs> you. Oh, enjoy it now, Monty. We'll work it for the beach, Dad. Reminds me of Prooma or Sheridan Beach. Yeah. How it always. Well, it looks clean water, but I wouldn't yeah. want to drink it. <laughs> Must be probably off the road. Probably off the roads, maybe. Yeah. A bit of road water. Oh, it's sinking. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> It's not training material, no, it's not. <laughs> That's it, one happy dog. That's all he wants in life. It's a bit of it, a bit of beach to run on. And uh, yeah, you can take dogs on the beach here up to the sailing club, which is uh, it's a bit further up past that junction, the sailing club. Right, that's all right then. What, nowhere else? Well, no, nowhere on the main there. drag. <laughs> It's beautiful down here, nice water. It's not your skeggy beach colour water. <laughs> beach is a bit sloppy though. We've got a sloppy beach. Mm. Hey, Lee. And a happy Come dog. On. One really, really happy dog. <laughs> Yay! Ah, 
the weather's changed a little bit now we're back Boo enjoyed the beach fully didn't you Bull Bull but he's uh, sliding the Martin bottom of there so we need to put something a bit grippier on in the bottom or we'll put his little crate back up uh, he can sit inside that because he just slides about. He went too bad on way back, wasn't he? No, it was a lot better on way back. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Yeah, he loved it. Better on the way back. He, he loved it. He loved it because he went on the beach. Yeah. I think he knew we were going to the beach, so he absolutely loved it. But it's that time of day. I think it's tea time soon. Yeah. Cup of tea time. Cold pop time. Good morning everybody. Morning. So we've decided, while the rest of the country is getting battered by that storm, it's quite nice on the south coast, mm. isn't it? Yeah. So uh, we're all refreshed from a good night's sleep and we're going to head off into Bognor Regis. Now we're not sure if we're getting the bus there, uh, Uber there, but we certainly can't walk there, it's a bit far. It is, yeah. Um, and Zach has a, a, got a bike, he's only got a scooter and you're not supposed to ride them in this country, so... We'll wait till we get the other bike before we do more bike excursions and it also saves parking up mm. the bikes so uh, it, there's no bus stop outside it's further down the road so we're going to go and have a look aren't we uh -huh. but uh, we've got the stagecoat app we've never had it before have we no it shows you where all buses are yeah it's really good and if you click on the bus stops it shows you the route they take and everything yeah which is really really handy because mm. we, we didn't know about that it gives you live updates on the buses as well yeah see where the bus is so you know if you've missed it or not mm. so uh, yeah off the head down to the bus stop obviously we've got to go the long way and we've got to go all the way up to the road and then back down over that way mm. <laughs> Zach likes the long way no I don't this is where you come in in the van it was very narrow down here wasn't it uh, yes <laughs> really narrow to get into the site <laughs> But well, well tucked out the way. Mm. Very quiet and peaceful. Yes, it is very quiet and peaceful. And that's what we like. Mm. It's got a chicken and a rooster, and the rooster weren't too noisy this morning. We did tell us it's a lazy rooster. Yeah, <laughs> proper was lazy, aren't we? <laughs> that was about half eight. <laughs> yeah, about half eight when it got up. <laughs> so yeah, if you come here, it's a very tight. Oh, a lot of these are quite tight because of people's houses and gardens. But yeah, if we can get down, you can get down. Yeah, if you get down here in a nine metre motor home, anybody can get down here. Right, we found the bus stop. It was only about a mile, wasn't it, from site? Yeah. <laughs> it's just across the uh, bus every 10 minutes, number 700 into Bognor. Yeah, there's plenty of shops around here. And kebab places. It's got me wanting a kebab, it has. That, we've made it in on the bus. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's a bit fresher here, isn't it? It is, it's very fresh here. Yeah. And nice. Zach is already excited because he's seen the splash park, <laughs> hasn't he, Zach? Yeah, I'm not so excited. And you bought your trunks. <laughs> Go right down there on the splash park. I'm excited because there's kebab shops everywhere. Yeah. We want kebabs. Should have brought shower gel down because yeah. I had a free shower here, <laughs> Zach. Oh, wow. Oh. Hey. Oh. He's enjoying it, I'm getting yeah. wet. Yep. <laughs> He's really enjoying it. it is smell the sea air. Can't beat a bit of sea air in your lungs. Oh, it smells lovely. Why are you being total? Smell it. Oh, ah. Aeroplane blowing it. Glowing. Aeroplane towing a glider up. Zaki spotted that. Beautiful sea. Right, if you want some pebbles, Zach. Yeah. Loads of pebbles. Right there. I was just saying when we first got down here we should have put shorts on because they were roasting. <laughs> Coming out front we were like, I'm glad they didn't put shorts on. And now we wish we'd put shorts on. <laughs> yeah. It's one of them. When yeah. the sun's out it is baking hot. Yeah. But when it's in, it is in. Now I think you take dogs a bit further down on here. I, don't think, need to walk any further, I think it's we past Butlins, but yeah we've made it as far as Butlins. Over there. Would have been nice to have seen how much it were to get on there, but mm. probably they don't allow touring caravans on there, not sure. But we we'll probably want to head up and then go for, down into town, maybe. Yeah. I think there's a bit more to see in town. Let's have a look on Google Maps first. Consult Google Maps. You can show them the beautiful beach. Here 
is that? <laughs> Somebody's had a Somebody's crash there. Uh, wallop that, aren't they? Yes, the they have. Bit of a funky apartment block there. Mm. Uh, very strange. Yeah, there's not a lot to see on the front other than the beachy pebbles. And, and obviously coffee shops. Yeah, and we can't go on there because of boo. So we're heading up this way. Uh, and there's a park with a miniature highway, apparently. Yeah. I miss going to Butlins. I know, I miss Butlins as well. Going for a swim and a splash of ice, good. Mm. Hotham Park. We've got a play area, a railway, a boating lake, a cafe. Mm. It's got it all going on in mm. here. Let's go and have a look. Camping is strictly prohibited. Green Flag Award winning park. Uh, I think you can buy them. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. It's a bit sceptical, isn't it? Hotham Park to the centre. Boating lake, train, it's got. Let's go and see what's on today. And then we can walk up through here, back round to the town centre ish area. Look at that bit of a hotel bit on Butlins there. Mm. Mm. It's nice. Just been having a look, haven't we? But I don't think yeah. we've taken motorhomes and caravans here. Eh? Or dogs, probably. Mm. So, might be nice to go for a mini break. Yeah. Because we've been to. Butlings in Skegness. Oh, we used to love that. Didn't Hundreds of times. We'll yeah, we'll have, we'll have a look when we sit down. We'll be digging deep. Oh, look. The best thing I did, and I want you to know, was letting you in from that moment I knew that you were all I missed. Baby, it took just one. Get Rob down here, could you, Zach? Mm -hmm. It's alright, we'll send you in first then. Yes, you go first, Zach. If <laughs> you, you take the guard Rob. dog in front. You can hear all the kids at the school having a good time. Mm. Must be an infant school. Yeah, it sounds like primary school. Screaming. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Enjoying themselves on the lunchtime. Yes. So we need to uh, figure out how to get into town. And as usual, we'll come out and our phones are about flat. Mm -hmm. So we've got like 15% left, we're trying to save it. Boo's out walking again. Waddling. Waddling. <laughs> Waddling. Uh, he's dropping in so he wants to be back in. He's a nice one in the park, that's a classic. Right, we're getting a bit hungry, so we're heading back down into the high street. See what we can find, eh, Zach? Yeah. Have a look round. I fancy some chips. Catherine fancies chips, I fancy kebab, and Zach fancies... I don't know. I don't, <laughs> I don't know. know. Whatever one of them is. Don't know if they do them down here. Mm, maybe There's not. the bus, quick. <laughs> oh, it is actually the right bus. Yes, yeah, they run every 10 minutes, I think it is, so... Look at that, two buses at the same time, both 700s. <laughs> um, sure there's too many of them. We've seen, we've seen it when we come the other way. Oh Two 700s pulled up at the same time, yeah, both to Chichester. Chichester. Yeah. It's good for us when we want to get back. Yeah. Well, it would be better if it like, went to our site. There's a barber's there. Is that, do you need a haircut yet? No, not yet. Yeah. Not, not yet. Soon. Before we go abroad. Yeah. Have a holiday haircut. Yeah. <laughs> we used to sell some interesting stuff. Well, there. This one for you, Catherine. Mm. Charity shop. Hmm. So that needs to rest his back a minute. So Catherine says there's an ideal location for him to rest his feet or his back mm -hmm. outside the charity shop. Yep. And so she can nip in and have a look around. Mm. Oh. Oh. 
Oh, look, is it a pub, Zaki? That might have been a better idea. Uh, yeah. Or there's that pub. That pub there. Yeah. Well, we can always nip over on the way back. What, to the pub? Yeah. Ke kebab place, but it's shut. Mmm, typical. Sex found where the internet lives. It lives wow. up there on that that's building. Radio, look. That's radio and internet. One, one massive tower block just in the middle. Nothing else. How strange. One big. Well, that's the home of the internet, isn't it, Zach? Yeah, that's that like one. It. Everybody in there will be getting millions. God, they'll have very good internet, <laughs> won't they? Well, I'd hope you've got good internet up there. Especially top floors. Probably not good for your health with all them antennas around you. Uh, <laughs> Well, there is a benefit of living up there, the views you'd get. Oh, aye. Right. Sea view. <laughs> you yeah. would definitely get a sea view from up there, straight across all the houses and shops. Ooh. Another kebab shop short. <laughs> Not meant to get one, you know that. I've never really had a kebab at dinner, but I could uh, demolish one today. <laughs> but we think we're going to Witherspoons. Uh, we're not sure. Zach's the map reader. Yeah. Right, is that? Yeah, the only one with a good amount of battery. <laughs> yes. Yes, that looks like a Witherspoons to me. Yeah. Hey, we found a Chinese buffet. That'd do Mark from Northerners on tour, that wouldn't it? Uh -huh. All you can eat buffet in there. <laughs> oh. Oh, that smells good, doesn't it? For the northerners, you know, chicken fried rice. Yes, <laughs> Mark would be in there, he'd yeah. be all over that. Spoons. Yeah. What is it, the Budweiser you want, the Stella? Mm. You have to something. Just trying to get round to the uh, outdoor seating, hopefully. Just seat we haven't walked very far. Yeah, oh, the sea's only just over there. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah, you can get through the gate, look. This has to be a first for me at Witherspoons. I'm mm. having a, a coffee. Well, a latte to be precise, but yeah, fancy the change. You having something to eat, Zaki? Um, yeah, I think I might have a boneless basket. Mmm, what from here? Yeah. If you notice, Zach's got red blotches on him. We've all got them. We've all been bitten by mosquitoes, Even haven't on my we? Face, yep. Zach's been bitten on his face. His feet have been bitten. Yep. Legs chewed to pieces in the last couple of nights. Yeah, we have. Ah. Huh? It was me the first night. All up this arm. There's Catherine's about eight with an empty cup. What's up there? I'll leave them to it. Oh. Right. There's two of them stood looking at the coffee machines. Neither of them knows how to refill them. Oh dear. Can you remember the way back? Yeah. Take three. Yeah. <laughs> we and Catherine are alright because we had about four coffees each at Witherspoon. Yeah. So uh, we've got plenty of energy. <laughs> Zach ain't got much energy but we've got an half a mile walk back now from the bus. Yeah. We wanted a kebab but everywhere was shut. And the only place that was open looked a bit mm, yes. grim. Very, yeah. very grim and very run down. Grim is a good word. <laughs> yeah, Bogner Regis is a bit run down. It is, to be fair. It's needs not a bit of a re it needs a bit of a revamp. Mm. I'll but tell you what I want. I want a seaside town that we can have a walk around that's a bit like a mini Scarborough. A few amusements, a few fish and chip places. I love that sort some of nice seaside. You should just want some fish and chips. I do. But we also need a wee. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, we've got a bit of a walk back, but it's all right. Boo's happy. He's quite happy. Boo's happy enough in there. He's been asleep in there. He's been laid flat out. <laughs> yeah, so we're going to get back to the van hopefully before it rains. Catherine's phone's gone flat. Mine's got about 2% in it. Well, mine's got about 80. Zach's the brainy one who yeah. charged his up first before we came out. Zach's doing very well today. <laughs> I'm normally the only one who has a dead phone. Oh, we've had a bit of a mozzie attack though, haven't we, Zach? Yes. Look at him, look. Yeah, you do know. I've already shown him. Oh, at, have you? Yeah. At Spoons. <laughs> all up his arm. When we were at Spoons, not, uh, not okay. having a beer. I don't know what that were all about. <laughs> I think we need to go home and get back out of bed the right side. <laughs> I enjoy their coffee, I need it's to wait nice. for my phone to die and you two need to charge them. <laughs> yeah, be the other way around like normal. Yeah. Just got back and it just started raining. Mm, just timed it right, didn't we? Well, only a little drizzle, it wouldn't have mattered that much, would it? No. But uh, it's been nice to go out. Boo, mm. Boo's enjoyed it because he gets yes. all the new sniffs. Mm. 
Zach enjoyed it in the end, despite <laughs> all the moaning. <laughs> he can't hear us at minute, he's got his headphones on. <laughs> but he moaned like hell about going out, oh, I'm not going out again. But he enjoyed it once mm. he got out there. He does, he does. So we just had a nice sandwich for dinner, because mm -hmm. we didn't get anything in the end. Because I wanted a kebab, but the place we found looked a bit manky, so it's yeah. like, mm, I'm not going to get one. Mm -hmm. We'll get one another day from somewhere. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so we're just going to relax at the van now. Well, I say relax. I have to get my laptop out and do a load of video editing, mm -hmm. stuff like that. Mm -hmm. Got some emails to answer. Yeah, and We've then got to relax. Just catch up, haven't we, on stuff? But we definitely don't need no more coffee. <laughs> we had plenty yeah. of coffee. Here. The good thing about Weatherspoons is, is you get one cup, one pound twenty-five, and mm -hmm. you can just keep getting as many as you want. Free but, refills. Yeah. But yeah, the problem with coffee is, is you can have a bit too much. Mm. <laughs> Yeah. So uh, we'll catch up a bit later when we make some tea, eh? Mm -hmm. You're itching your leg, he's been bitten oh, to death bitten overnight, everywhere. he's itching his leg. <laughs> bitten absolutely everywhere, and so has Zach. Mm -hmm. so it must be here, it must be this place. It, it was be. a bit like it at the last place as well, to mm. be fair. Little mozzy things it's about... wet ground under trees though, isn't it? They come alive. Yes, little rascals. <laughs> what is it they say about magpies? If you see one, one for sorrow, two for well, bad luck, whatever they say, what I'm going to see about ten of them all in the same field. What does that indicate? Because there's loads of magpies here. <laughs> Is that good luck or bad luck? It's gone grey. Don't know what's happened to it, whatever, but tomorrow we're hoping to head to a castle. Hmm, so that should be interesting. But yeah, nobody's joined us, so we've had all this field to ourselves. So I think tomorrow night we'll probably, if we do head to this castle, we'll do a wild camp afterwards. Um, and then we should be heading up to, pro hopefully, that bike will be coming and we'll be heading to pick that up. We're trying to decipher what's off for tea, aren't we? But mm. It's like, ooh, got plenty of eggs, we'll have egg, chips and beans. We're getting we've towards, got no beans. We're getting towards nearing need to go shopping. Yes, we haven't been since yesterday, so we're getting <laughs> ready. And it's like, right, we'll have this. Oh, we ain't got that. Mm. <sighs> and then Catherine says, shall I go to chip shop? And it's like, ooh. Don't you get know. the bike out and I'll go. I can't be involved to even get the bike out. Well, I'll not be going then. <laughs> no. Just send one of the magpies, there's loads of them out here. I know. I counted 14 magpies out here this <sighs> morning. I have never seen so many magpies all in one place. Oh, dear me. I'm tired, and it? It's only half past four. Mm. It's tiring doing notes. It what is. I say, doing notes. Being on the laptop. It's been a nice day out, really, hasn't right, it? Right, let's decide what we're having for tea. She's made me mess my garage up and I've had to get the bike out. But Catherine is adamant we're having chips. So she's going to pop down the chip shop. And uh, that looks like what we're having for tea. Hey, if they do kebabs down at chip shop. I wanted a kebab earlier, didn't I? You did. I forgot about that. Kebab place might even be open. It's tea time now, so yeah. Yeah, I'd have a kebab, salad, chilli sauce. Mm. Looks like tea's just arrived. The takeaway lady's here. I oh know, delivered to your door in the middle of a field. Delivered to our door. What have we got in here? Oh. Get this bag open. Well, that'll be well shaken. <laughs> it's not the smoothest of rides. Shaken. Oh, I'll put my salad. Oh, yummy. Mm. What have we got in here? Several um, bags of yeah. several this. The kebab and the chips are separate. Mmm. This is that one. Uh, mine's chicken burger and chips, so that one's mine. That's yours. Yep. That's Zach's and that's mine. There we go. Yummy. So we've got a couple of Barney coffee thanks this week to give as well. We have. We've got Lynette. Thank you very much. Thank you. And uh, Irish George yet again. Thank Bless you, George. Him. Thank Bless you, you very much. much. Thank you, mate. Thanks. Much appreciated. It is very much appreciated. Looks like Zach's got chicken and chips, has he? Ooh. He has. A bit like KFC. I mm. know oh, quite how he's going to eat all that, but wow, they're big pieces of chicken. Wow. <laughs> I've got a big kebab, mm. salad, and chips. That's <laughs> definitely going to fill me up. <laughs> Might be like two days worth of food here. Yes, I was just thinking that. I was just yeah. thinking, wow, that's a lot of meat. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, 
want to thank everybody for watching uh, we're gonna end this one here this yeah. week and uh, we will see you in the next one yep yeah, we will we'll see you in the next one